In Germany, you can't go further east than Gorlitz. This river marks the Polish border. Today, carefully restored architecture speaks of a rich history, but there are echoes of the recent communist past too. After German reunification, money poured in, but well-paid jobs didn't follow. Young people left. Unemployment is higher than elsewhere, pensions much lower. It has proved fertile ground for the far right. Over 30% voted for Alternative for Deutschland here. It is the party's heartland. Heigo Exner and Ramona Poniatowski are two of its supporters. Heigo used to vote for Angela Merkel. Ramona never voted. It's a people's party, and it talks to the people, not like the other parties. And for me, it's their social agenda, dealing with poverty, health cuts, all the things we lack. Immigration was a defining factor, and no one asked what we, the people, wanted. They just went ahead. And for me personally, 2015, I thought this country was going under. Opposition to the mass migration of 2015 is the usual reason given to explain the AFD's success. Here in Gorlitz, it was an important factor, but it wasn't the only one. People will tell you they feel left behind, economically and politically, and that Germany's traditional parties have failed them for too long. By voting for AFD, they hope to shake things up. Sebastian Wippel, Gorlitz, born and bred, now represents the party in Saxony's regional parliament in Dresden. The AfD is not a racist party. AfD is first and foremost a German party. Our focus is people who have been here a long time, both Germans and foreigners who have integrated. We want to be their voice. Angela Merkel was Europe's most powerful politician, but many of her traditional supporters punished her by voting AFD. As a result, she's now struggling to put together a new coalition with the left of center SPD. Even if she succeeds, her new government is unlikely to deliver the radical policies voters in Gorlitz want. So now, even in Germany, right-wing populists have carved out their own space in national politics. And they could be here for a long time. Simon McGregor with TRT World, Gorlitz in eastern Germany.